In today's tutorial, we're learning how to make this beautiful choppy crop effect in Canva in just a few simple clicks, also including that scrapbook animation. And we're starting from a blank canvas. Now, first, let's change the background color to something vibrant red. That way, the picture will stand out a lot more. Next, we go to the Elements tab, and here we want to look for a picture. I'm going to go for a dog with sunglasses, see what we can find there. And in the Pictures tab, in the Photos tab, we can find a lot of nice examples. So you can pick whichever one you like, you can do it with any type of picture. Click it and add it to the screen. And now we go to the Apps tab on the left. You can see I already have it here, but if we delete it, this is the default. You go to the Apps tab, and then you can type in Choppy Crop press enter and this will give you a few options we're looking for this yellow one here the choppy crop open that one up and that will install the application now what this allows us to do is it allows you to create a custom crop on an image so if we click you see that a line will appear a dotted line and a anchor point so you can click once more and that way you can see that you're starting to get this zigzag line around the picture that you're outlining so you can really use any custom shape that you like. You don't have to do it in this crappy shape. I'm just going to do it for this example here. Just click all the way around until you have a nice outline of that picture. You can do it in more or less crops. That is totally fine. And then at the end, you just connect it back to the starting point. Click that and it will have created this crop effect. You can see a preview at the bottom. And if you're happy, you just add it to your design. Now we have two layers, the original picture and the cropped image. I'm going to delete the original one. And now we have this crop effect. It already looks quite nice on the slide, but if you want to have it stand out a little bit more, you can go to edit image and then go to the shadow tab here in the effects, outline, and let's make the outline completely white and then increase the size to, I think in this case, 55 will be good. And that way you can scale up or down the image as you like and place it anywhere on the slide. Now you can repeat this step for multiple pictures and that will give you quite a nice effect on your slide. So let's add some extra elements here. I've already prepared a few. And now we look at the animation part. So this process was entirely the same for the others. Now we select all three objects. We go to animate. And now this scrapbook effect will look quite good in combination with that croppy choppy crop that we have created. And now let's preview what we have. And this is how you can create this choppy crop effect in Canva in just a few minutes, but also a nice animation of those images on your slide. And it really creates a dynamic effect.